College students are dropping pens and pencils for electronics to take notes during lectures, but whether they are actually focusing remains uncertain. There's this great temptation to be doing any number of other things, roaming Facebook, roaming the web, looking at CNN and a myriad of other websites. Distractions on the screen forces students to become multitaskers, which Barnes feels is not a good thing. And in the end, they walk away and they go, gee, wonder what happened during that lecture. I was there. I've come to all the classes, but I hardly heard a word. Why? Because you had this wonderful screen in front of you. Sophomore Connor Almaroth feels that a computer makes it convenient to his studies. You're not hustling to find your notebook or this notebook or these notes. You have it all right on your computer. But he admits to often finding himself switching between windows. It costs money to be here. So I try not to be too distracted. Psychology professor Brandy Fraser notices that the number of laptop users in her class grows every semester. It's not my job to police people being on task with their laptops. That's not something I can really do. I can hope that people will be. Um, but in terms of taking notes, I don't have a problem with it. As someone who puts a good amount of information on my PowerPoints. Um, I know sometimes students, I know if I have too much information, I see students like shaking their hand and, you know, I think some of them prefer sort of typing as opposed to writing stuff down. I think teachers don't mind as long as you're responsible about it. With more courses using Laulima, UH's online course management system, both students and professors can expect to see more laptops in the classroom. This is Kaiser Noales with Campus Connections.